This is a special space weather alert due to inclement solar flare activity. We have coronal mass ejection plasma shock waves coming to Earth from X7 and X9 solar flares. Each produced an eruption of charged material from the corona. Our last two videos hit the X7 event and how the CME is expected to arrive tomorrow night, Friday, October 4th. NOAA is forecasting level 1, 2, or 3 geomagnetic storms, somewhere between mild to strong conditions with a good chance for aurora. But now we've got more. Right after the morning show today, an X9 solar flare erupted from the same sunspot group, and it has also produced a coronal mass ejection. The sunspot may not be done yet, so we're going to keep watching, but the last couple hours I've been eagerly awaiting updates to the ultraviolet imagery and the coronagraphs. SDO images pretty clearly show that a CME was released, and the early images from SOHO show another full halo CME, in addition to other CMEs going off the limbs. This one was stronger, likely faster, and is traveling in the cleared wake of the first CME, so it is likely to arrive Saturday, October 5th. Nobody has official storm forecast yet, but if both end up hitting in close succession, we're looking at KP7 or 8 at a minimum, level 3 or 4 geomagnetic storm conditions, and another low latitude auroral event, possibly lasting for two or three days. Now this is not quite at the scary kill shot level, but there's a greater than 50% chance of network outages, power disruption, and about a 10% chance of major electrical fires, transformer explosions, infrastructure failures, and grid damage. We will have more if necessary, and at very least, we'll be back in the morning for the daily update. Be safe, everyone.